I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Shouldn't there be auras or someone from the Ministry guarding the school after the incident in Hogsmeade? Revelio! Accio! Revelio! Potions is one of the most challenging and hazardous subjects taught at this school. As fifth years, you will be required to reach new heights of both discipline and intellect. You will begin this term by brewing a Wigan Weld Potion. Mr. Takar, can you tell us why this particular potion might come in handy? Yes, Professor Sharp. The Wigan Weld Potion can be used to sterilize and even heal a variety of injuries. It can heal some injuries, but not all. Point for Ravenclaw. Before today's class is completed, each of you will have brewed a Wigan Weld Potion of your own. You never know when you might need it. Please begin. Use a strong, even motion when crushing your ingredients.
Please be meticulous when adding powder to your potions. One errant sneeze could be disastrous. I see most of you have not forgotten how to stir. Hmm. Not an easy potion to brew. Well done. And from what I hear of your recent exploits in Hogsmeade, you'd also do well to practice brewing the defensive Edurus potion. Professor Weasley had you acquire the recipe from Jay Pippins, correct? Yes, sir. Good. For the moment, you can find the ingredients you need in my office. But in the future, you'll be expected to provide your own ingredients. Some can be harvested from the plants you grow in your herbology class, and rarer ones can be purchased. Others, however, may be harder to obtain, and will require you to be a bit more... resourceful. Come and see me when you've finished brewing, and we'll see if it was skill or luck the first time around. Revelio. Professor Sharp said that my parents considered keeping me home from school this year after the rumor. Did I hear Professor Sharp say that you have permission to go into his office? He did say that. He wants me to get more ingredients to brew another potion. Brilliant! You, my friend, have been presented with an extraordinary opportunity. You remember me, don't you? Gareth Weasley. Ah, yes. We met in the common room. Listen. Anyone with a troll-sized brain can brew an Adjurus potion. I'm working on something that's certain to be spectacular. I'm just missing one tiny last ingredient that will add that extra spark. I suspect that's where I come in. You're as clever as I'd hoped. I simply need a single Fooper feather, as you'll already be in Sharp's office with his permission. Perhaps you could grab it for me. I'll get you the Fooper feather, as long as you're certain Sharp won't miss it. I assure you he won't. Fruit feathers aren't that valuable. Revelio. A well prepared. Revelio. Don't fret if you run out of ingredients. Remember, precision is key when brewing potions. Here's the Fwapa feather you wanted. Brilliant! Thank you! This is going to take a moment to brew. You should get back to brewing your Adjurus potion, and I'll tell you when... Revelio. Proficiency in potions are two things that cannot be rushed. Have patience and be thorough. Revelio. Professor Sharp must have learned a lot during his time as an aura. I wish he talked about it more. My Wiganwell potion's utter rubbish. 
Wish I could just replace it with one from J. Pippins. Now we add the mallow sweet. Rebellion. And... That's odd. What's happening? Wait, it's not supposed to. Ah! Get it! Oh! Dragon dog! What happened? <laughs> well done, Gareth. What now, Mr. Weasley? Sorry, Professor. That'll be points from Gryffindor. Again. I was impressed that you were able to answer Professor Sharp's question about the Wiggle Meld potion. Oh, you're the new student. I've heard much about you. Um, thank you. I'm Amit, by the way. A pleasure, truly. And I've never seen anyone brew such a flawless Wiggenwald potion on their first try. Well done. I'm glad I was able to get it right the first time. You must simply have a knack for potion making. Some students seem so confounded by potion recipe. A fascinating language, by the way. Neither here nor... Merlin's beard. Good conversation is the enemy of free time. I must... Speaking of stars, we'll be in astronomy together. You'll love it. Rebellion. Mr. Weasley did not do this on his own. His accomplice will answer to me as well. I brewed an Adura's potion as you asked, Professor. I'm surprised you had the time. You seemed rather busy helping Mr. Weasley brew chaos. I'm sorry, Professor. I was merely trying to help a friend. Taking responsibility for one's actions does go a long way with me. I shall assume that you've learned a lesson. As for the work you did today at your own cauldron, I will say you've done well. I confess I was skeptical given the advanced nature of this class and the fact you're a new student i'm glad i was able to meet your expectations a rare occurrence and you do well to remember that you're not a potions master quite yet in addition to having a solid grasp of how to combine various ingredients you should gain an understanding of the ingredients themselves pay particular attention in herbology the plants you nurture there are often essential to the potions you brew here now that'll be all Revelio. I think each of us has had enough excitement for one day. Class is dismissed. That was an interesting class. Thanks to you. Wasn't precisely what I had in mind, but it was still brilliant. I appreciate your help. I hope Sharp wasn't too disagreeable when you handed in your potion. Heard him talking about taking responsibility. Professor. Best be. Revelio. Sir Nicholas, our house ghost, is looking for you. You can find him near the great. Nice underclothes. I hate to see a creature get put down like that. But trolls have no business in Hogsmeade. Where do the professors... Ugh, my robes are going to reek from Gareth's inspiration. No. Off on another Is adventure, are we? Rebellion. Huh. 
Incendio. Revelio. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. Incendio, Accio, Revelio. Incendio, Levioso, Accio. Revelio. Do you have a moment? Were you calling me, Gareth? I was. After you helped me with that fupa feather and potions, I reckoned you might be just the person I need. You see, I have an idea for a fizzing, wisby inspired beverage, but I'm missing a key ingredient. <laughs> you and your concoction. Sounds simple. Couldn't you have... They're not for sale. So, the reliable way... Are you asking? It's a sweets ingredient. I'll see. Revelio. I'll need to get those dried billywigs things for Gareth if he's to finish his latest concoction. Are you there? A one-eyed witch statue shouldn't be too hard to find. You wanted to see me, sir? Yes, Sir Nicholas de Mimsy Porpington, at your service. Nice to meet you, Sir Nicholas. I know about the book you found and its missing pages. I may be able to help. Follow me, if you will. It's not too far. Wait, how do you know about the book? And that it's missing pages? Word gets around amongst the ghosts. Rebellion. You were spotted with Mr. Sallow in the restricted section. Don't worry. Your secret's safe with me. This may be a leap, but I believe I know who ended up with those pages. I'd be happy to take you to him, if you'd be so kind as to perform a small favor for me along the way. Hmm, a small favor in exchange for getting those pages. Yes, it's, it's nothing really. I'd be grateful if you could simply go into the kitchen and procure a little rotten roast beef. Revelio. What are you up to now? Oh, I beg your pardon. Roast beef. Rotten roast beef. That is correct. Rotten roast beef. 
If one floats through it just right, one can almost taste it. Mm. Revelio. Ugh. I suppose you do that. But why me? It's simple, my young friend. My ghostly form cannot carry it. Now, if you'd be so kind as to collect the roast beef, I shall explain everything else in due course. Ah, here we are. Tickle the Revelio. Pear. Head on in. Did you say tickle the pear? Yes, in the painting. I'll wait right here. Uh, do try not to get in the way of the house elves. Mm, I'm already imagining the sweet aroma of rotten roast beef. A student Never will in the kitchen. Students. What could be delicious food and what found themselves a bit Revelio. It smells glorious in here. Here's a welcome treat. Delicious. Revelio. There's a disgusting smell. I must be getting close. Oh, a student? What a treat! What can Finky get for you? A pumpkin pasty? Perhaps some Welsh rabbit? Sounds lovely, but what I really need is this rotten roast beef. Ah, Nick sent you, didn't he? Please help yourself. Think he supposes Nick's tired of loitering about simply to experience the faintest memory of the taste of food. Do you and the other house elves conjure the food served in the Great Hall? Goodness, no. Not even house elves can conjure food out of thin air. Food is one of the five principal exceptions to Gantt's law of elemental transfiguration. We can, however, multiply it, transform it, and, of course, prepare it. Then we send it straight up to the Great Hall. Do you and the other house... Goodness, no. Food is... a we... Are there... Is it... It was nice to meet you. Happy to help. Who knew all of this was going on right beneath our feet? Revelio. Here's a welcome treat. Delicious. Here's a welcome treat. Delicious. Think he keeps all us house elves in line here in the kitchen? It's all right. She's the kind of... Here's a welcome treat. Delicious. Revelio. Master's house elf Scrope sometimes sneaks into the kitchen late at night to pilfer a morsel. 
We look the other way. Revelio. Ah, you're back. No trouble, I take it? Not at all. Fienke sends her regards, along with the rotten roast beef. Ah, glad to hear it. Kind elf, Fienke. Now, let's get that beef to Sir Patrick Delaney Podmore, and you'll be one step closer to finding those pages. This is all rather cryptic, Sir Nicholas. What's going on? Terribly sorry. I'm getting ahead of myself. Sir Patrick organizes the Headless Hunt, a group of headless ghosts who gather for various, uh, headless activities. Headless activities? Uh, yes, uh, you'll see. Anyway, I don't know how, but a member of that hunt, Richard Jackdaw, had the pages when he was alive. My plan is to take the rotten roast beef to Sir Patrick so that he'll allow me, uh, us, to engage with the hunt and speak to Jackdaw. Uh, shall we? I thought... Offering the beef to Sir Pat... What? Is the headless... Very well. Ow! Do stay behind me. It's a Patrick we want. Oi, Nesta! Look who's here! What have we told you, nearly headless Nick? Hello, Sir Amzad. Do let us pass. We've brought a little something for Sir Patrick. Probably come to try to beg his way in again. <laughs> <laughs> Do they always talk to you like that? Oh, all in good fun. Once Sir Patrick lets me join the headless hunt, I'll be right there with them. This offering is sure to win him over. Uh, don't forget why I'm here, sir. Rest assured, you'll have your information from young Jackdaw in no time. Wherever he may be. What I'd give for a flagon of mead or a nice leg of lamb right about now. Then this party would be complete. How about the next best thing, Sir Patrick? Ah, Sir Nicholas. And a student. Who let you in? Uh, we brought you a gift. This is all very suspicious. What do you really want? As if I need to ask. Um, it, it's Richard Jackdaw. Uh, where can we find him? Uh, may we speak to him? Jackdaw, eh? Why, here he is now. What a shame. Without his head. I bet you've always wondered what that's like, eh, Nick? <laughs> <laughs> Sir, you jazz. <sighs> it's bound to be around here somewhere. Probably being used in a game. If you find it, I give you my permission to speak with him, my young model. <laughs> it's the least I can do for you for bringing this putrescent gift home. Uh, sir, there's another matter I wish to discuss with you, if I may. Tut, tut, Sir Nicholas. How many times do I have to tell you our entry requirements are quite... Yeah. But, sir, I... Uh, we aren't the headless except for a little bit of tendon hunt, after all. Now, please, follow me and I shall help you find your way out. Farewell, my young friend. Perhaps your luck with these chaps will be better than mine. Revelio. for games. Hmm, a map. It doesn't appear to be connected to the missing pages. Best hang on to it for now. Nothing like the feeling of a breeze through my hair. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> 
Undertaker. Ironic, really. Never been as level headed as I am now. Revelio. Never this entertaining. Revelio. to play a game of hide and seek amongst the pumpkins. Akio. Levioso. Akio. Revelio. Hello again. Can you help me? Ah, Sir Nicholas's young friend. Has he abandoned you? Not at all. I need to speak to Richard Jackdaw. Sir Patrick said his head might be around here somewhere. Indeed it might be. Hmm. It is a bit unorthodox to include a mortal, but if you do wish to speak with him... Oh, why not? You can speak with Jackdaw if you can find his head amongst these pumpkins. Not just once, but five times. Good old Dumfrey will move the head to a different spot each time you find it. Those are the rules. What say you? Why are you using Jackdaw's head for this game? Well, if you must know, Jack... Please, could you explain the rules again? How did you have? Oh, treason is... If that's... Revenue. Begin! Cast away until you find him! Where can I find Jackdaw's head? You'll have to... Those are the rules. What? If that... Ma that ghost said I should blast away to my heart's content. Revelio. Levioso. I've never seen a place like that. Incendio. And then I would be the one to clean up this mess. Revelio. Levioso. Accio. Levioso. Where can I find Jack? You'll have to play our game. Those are the rules. Please, could you explain the rules again? Find his head amongst the pumpkins five times. Use your wand. I cannot be more specific than that. If that... Discovered a 
Whatever you say, Dumfrey. Where can I find Jack? Not head? my finest moment. Rebellion. Clean up this mess. Rebellion. Who would have thought a mortal would be so good at this? You've almost got him. Rebellion. You make this look easier than it's supposed to be. I could do that too if I had a wand. Then I will be the one to clean up this mess. Rebellion. I've never seen it played like that. Well, good job, I suppose. But we're not through with you. Rebellion. Well done. Of course, having a wand served you well. Still, I believe congratulations are in order. Not too bad for a mortal. Now, say what you need to say to old Jack Door here. Hmm? Nicely. No, I'm not. Sir Nicholas. Merlin's beard. The map on those pages led me to my demise. I was not ready for what awaited me in that cave. The pages are likely still mouldering away with my, uh, uh, remains. Quite a f The pages are why you look- Yes. <sighs> Say. Did someone- What would- how is it? I need... Rebellion! than Hogsmeade. Incendio! Rebellion.
Levioso. <laughs> Revelio. Rebellion. Rebellion. Rebellio. Incendio. Akio. I don't think I'm ready for this just yet.
What was you? What do you think you're doing? Love you. If I have so much of a scratch on me, you. Revelio. Avoiding our problems, are we? Incendio. No. Reductor. Let me go. Learn that in first year, did ya? Can bring on. Did you learn that in your face, clumsy little Incendio. fool? Accio. That's just pitiful. To get this claw? Leviosa. Who's this you? Predator. The beast Rebellion. Revelio. Rebellion. This looks intriguing. Revelio. Rebellion. Rebellion. 
Revelio. Nothing to poach in air insurance except spiders. Oh, well, you're the little son. Potato! Stick to him like a bellywick! Akio! Let <laughs> also! Incendio! Revelio. 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 When we're done here, I'm going straight to the hogshead. I know I'm not hearing things. Did you hear that? Somebody out there? Incendio! Ha! Another pitiful beat. You're the one who released the aren't you? Now, let me know something, my friend. Incendio! Shame nobody saw that. Revelio. What do you have in store for me this time? Akio. Levioso. Incendio. Revelio. Revelio.
Revelio. Rebellion. No more happy days for you. Petrificus totally. Oh, what's the light go out of your uh, eyes? Protego. I'm not done with you. You let Nora Treadwell go, didn't you? You're about to wish you hadn't. Petrificus totally. Protego. <laughs> You can't hold out forever. I know you're kind. You weaken me quickly. Incendio.
Revelio. You let Nora Treadwell go, didn't you? You're about to wish you hadn't. Revelio. Isn't Nora Treadwell's precious little guardian? Let me also. 
Revelio. Revelio. How nice to see you, my young friend. Get this over with, shall we? I have things to do. <laughs> Rebellion. Rebellio. Accio. Levioso. Rebellio. Accio. Lumos Revelio Accio Lumos Revelio Revelio. You're gonna regret coming here. This place has seen better days. Lumos. Off on another adventure, are we?
Revelio. What are you doing out here? Challenging you to a game of Summoner's Court. I think it's time you faced a real opponent, outside of Ronan's little lesson in charms class. Summoner's Court isn't just a game, it's a battle of skill. A test of a witch or wizard's metal. What say? I'm in. Let's do it. There you are. The Summoner's Court. The ever-changing game. Try to beat that. Missed the mark a bit on that one. Akio. All in the wrist. I've seen worse. Nothing to it. Accio. Merlin's pants. Wait, did I win? I won. <laughs> I'm game for an. Summoner's Court, the ever-changing game. Akio. Try to beat that. Akio. Not bad. Not bad. All in the wrist. You're not bad at this. Nothing to it. Accio. Eh, lucky shot. <laughs> we care to go again? I'm game for another round. Summoner's Court, the ever-changing game. Akio. Try to beat that. Akio. Was one for the ages.
all in the wrist. Didn't think you were a match for me. Akio. Nothing to it. Akio. I'll let you have that one. We should have kept... I'm game for another... Someone has caught the ever-changing game. Try to be that. Missed the mark a bit on that one. All in the wrist. One for the ages. Akio. Nothing to it. Akio. I'm game. Summon is caught. The ever-changing game. Akio. Come on, Neander. Oh. Akio. One for the ages. Akio. Try to be that. Not bad. Not bad. Akio. All in the wrist. Akio. Eh, lucky shot. Well done. You beat me. Bit of good luck, that's all. Come now, Leander. There's no need for that. Fine, you're good. Better than I am, at least. I'll let the, the others. I lost seven matches in a row to Samantha Dale. Chin up, Leander. Revelio. <laughs> Too tired to put on your robes.
Handy resource indeed, your Revelio. I hope you were able to take care. Professor, I completed all well. Pay close attention. The dis spell casting requires a focused mind and a steady wand. Good work. The dummy is here. Professor, do you have a moment? I do. What is it? I wondered, did you attend Hogwarts? I did. I am a proud member of Ravenclaw House. Why do you ask? I was curious as to how Hogwarts has changed over the years. I see. Well, the castle itself, as I'm sure you have surmised, is full of surprises. I dare say more than the staircases change around here. As for the students, well, they seem to get more capable every year. Although, we got up to just as much mischief in my day as you seem to now. I used to look the other way at all sorts of roguery when I was head girl. I can tell you, however, that I did once admonish a certain Phineas Nigella's flag for enjoying a sugar quill during a lecture. Uh, I, I hadn't realized that you and Professor Black were, uh, students here together. <laughs> Appearances can be deceiving. You see, I was once wounded by time itself. Time itself. Ah, well, it was the risk I took with my prior position. You may or may not have heard that I was an unspeakable at the Ministry for years. An unspeakable? What does... Ah. As you might suspect, I cannot speak about what we did. Suffice it to say, the job was not without its hazards. Now, I hope I've satisfied your curiosity for the moment. You have. Thank you for speaking with me, Professor. Keep up with your wand work. One must always be prepared for mischief, both inside and outside of the castle. Rebellion. Expelliarmus! You seem to have the right hand this stick, but keep your Very armed may save your life. Accio! Protego! Levioso! Incendio! Expelliarmus! Still at it, I see. I wonder who lives here. If you're here for my wares, 
After what Ranrock did to that goblin banker at Gringotts, I shouldn't be surprised at what happened to Arn. Not my fault you're a deadly great spider. Rebellion. Past the ruins. I'm on the right track. Revelio. An encampment. This must be it. Looks as if there's more than one way to enter. Arn will regret not joining us. He doesn't come round now. He'll be made even more. Let's see what's up here. <laughs> Expelliarmus. How many of you are there? Accio. Predator. Stop it. Leviosa. Expelliarmus. Incident. Accio. Spells I've not been fighting since before you were born. Rebellion. You will suffer. Not for a bit of dying, are we? Oh, my God. Uh. 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 Incendio. Accio. Protego. Leviosa. Expelliarmus. That was quite something. Now, to free Arn's cart. Revelio. Expelliarmus. Revelio Expelliarmus Incendio Accio Levioso Accio Incendio Revelio
quite an enchantment. The carts are returning to arm. Revelio. Oh, here's a pleasant surprise. Accio. Rebellion. Accio. Revelio Accio Revelio Accio Revelio Incendio Accio What's that? Revelio Revelio Accio, Expelliarmus. I know what that means. Merlin trial. Revelio. Accio. Revelio. Accio. Revelio. Revelio.
prove dangerous if I'm not careful. Revelio. I have good <gasps> Ram The ones What Revelio I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Revelio. <laughs> Lumos. Revelio. Revelio. What are you up to now? Revelio.
Revelio. Nice to see you, my young friend. Revelio. This looks like the right statue. Now, what was the password? Descendium. Goodness, who knew this was all down here? Rebellion. A lift must be how I get down. Looks broken, though. Revelio. Accio. Repairo. Revelio. That seems to have done the trick. This castle will never cease to surprise me. Rebellion. I'm trapped. How am I supposed to get out of here? Let me also. Revelio. I'm going to have to get past this. Let me also. Rebellion. Oh. Uh. Uh. Let me also. Rebellion. Let me also. Repair on. Let me also. Rebellion. Incendio! Rebellio! Repairo! One more to go and I'll make it across. Let me also!
Something is getting in the way of that platform. <laughs> Repair all. Let me also. Akio. Revelio. Levioso. Accio. Levioso. Aha, got it. Revelio. This must be the way. I need to find a way to open that gate. Incendio. Revelio. Something smells sweet. Must be close to honey jukes. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Revelio. Honey jukes. I can smell the chocolate. Now, where would I find the dried billywig stings for Gareth? I have the dried billywig stings. Now, back to Gareth. I can only imagine how his new recipe is going to turn out. Revelio. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Revelio. Incendio. Hello, Gareth. I have those dried... Happy... Revelio. 